Why Anansi has eight thin legs? A long, long time ago, there lived a spider named Anansi. Anansi loved to taste the food that others in the village made for themselves and for their families. One day, he stopped by the rabbit's house. Rabbit was his good friend. There are greens in your pot, said Anansi excitedly. They are not quite done yet, said the rabbit. But they will be soon. Stay and eat with me. I would love to. But I have some things to do, Anansi said hurriedly. I'll spin a web. I'll tie one end around my leg and one end to your pot. When the greens are done, tug on the web and I'll come running. Rabbit thought that was a great idea. So, it was done. I smell beans! Anansi sniffed excitedly as he ambled along. Delicious beans! Cooking in a pot! Come! Eat with us, cried the monkeys. The beans are almost done. I would love to, Uncle Monkey, said Anansi. And again, Anansi suggested he spin a web with one end tied around his leg and one end tied to the big bean pot. Monkey and his family thought that was a great idea. And so, it was done. Mm. I smell sweet potatoes. Anansi sniffed happily as he walked along. Sweet potatoes with honey, I guess. Anansi! Called his friend Hog. I am cooking sweet potatoes with honey. Wait till they are done and we can eat together. I would love to, said Anansi. And again, Anansi suggested he spin a web with one end tied around his leg and one end tied to the cooking pot. His friend Hawk thought that was a great idea. And so it was done. Oh, I smell carrots. Anansi sniffed excitedly as he walked along. Delicious carrots! Cooking in a pot! Come, eat with me! Said the ostrich. The carrots are almost done. Hmm, I would love to, but I am in a hurry, said Anansi. And again, Anansi suggested he spin a web with one end tied around his leg and one end tied to the cooking pot. The ostrich thought that was a great idea. And so it was done. 
Anansi met other friends on the way and tied the remaining legs to their cooking pots and pans. When he stopped by the river, he had one web tied to each of his eight legs. This was a wonderful idea. Anansi told himself proudly. I will have so many things to eat. I wonder whose meal will be ready first. Just then, Anansi felt a tug at his leg. Aha! said Anansi. That is the web string tied to rabbit's greens. He felt another and yet another. Anansi was pulled in all directions. Oh dear! cried Anansi painfully as his legs stretched because of the pulling. Anansi was pulled this way and that way as everyone pulled on the web strings at once. His legs were pulled thinner and thinner. Anansi rolled and tucked himself into the river. When all the webs had washed away, Anansi pulled himself up to the shore. Oh my! Oh my! sighed Anansi. Perhaps that was not such a good idea after all. To this day, Anansi the spider has eight very thin long legs. <laughs>